Hello students, today let us see an important result that is going to be used very frequently in, lat in a topic lattices under the chapter lattices and Boolean algebra. So first let us consider a lattice that is considered as a poset L comma with a relation less than or equal to relation. Take two elements A comma B belongs to L. Now A is related to B, A less than or equal to B if and only if a star b equal to a if and only if a plus b equal to a this is what we are going to prove first of all let, uh, let me explain the background of this result suppose there are two elements that are not comparable that are not related to each other a star b is the meet operation that is previously met in the uh, previous level a plus b is the joined operation that is going to be joined in the next level. So naturally a star b is a smaller element than a and b. Similarly a plus b is a larger element than a and b. So we have this uh, relationship, these inequalities. Now this result says that suppose the elements are comparable, they are related. For example a is smaller element, b is larger element. Then a star b is the smaller among the uh, two elements a comma b a plus b is the larger among a comma b this is what they want to tell so a plus b equal to b this is what we are supposed to prove now first let me prove this in uh, if and only necessary and sufficient condition assume a is related to b a is less than or equal to b by reflexive property we have this relationship also a is always related to a now if we combine these two inequality, we can tell A is a lower bound for these two elements, A comma B. And naturally, A star B is the greatest lower bound for A comma B. That is by definition. So I take it as 6. Now if we combine these two statements, A star B is the greater element and A is a smaller element. So this inequality happens. A less than or equal to a star b already we have this one a star b less than or equal to a that is from equation one uh, inequality one so if we combine these two x less than or equal to y y less than or equal to x x is related to y y is related to x using anti-symmetry property we will have x equal to y that is a star b equal to a so one way we have proved a less than or equal to a is related to b implies a star b equal to a and let us prove the another way a star b assume conversely a star b equal to a and let us prove a is related to b so a star b equal to a if you take from equation 2 from inequality 2, we will have a star b less than or equal to b, that is what written here. a star b equal to a, we have assumed. So naturally, a is related to b, a is less than or equal to b, we will have. Now, let us prove this one. a is related to b if and only if a plus b equal to b, or a less than or equal to b if and only if a plus b equal to b. So, first of all, assume A is related to B. Already using reflexive property, we have B is related to B. From these two inequalities, we say that B is an upper bound for these two elements A comma B. And the standard upper bound is A plus B, which is the least upper bound. So, if we combine these two statements, A plus B is smaller, B is greater. So we can write a plus b less than or equal to b. Now already we have b is less than or equal to a plus b. b is related to a plus b. If we use this one using anti-symmetry property, we can conclude a plus b is equal to b. And conversely, assume a plus b equal to b. And we have taken that a less than or equal to a plus b from equation 1, a less than or equal to a plus b. a plus b equal to b we have assumed. So naturally a is less than or equal to b is very obvious. 
so we have proved the converse part also with this the proof of this statement is over and this statement is going to be repeatedly used later in the proof of other theorems so let us see another theorem and problems in next video thank you